Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to our playthrough of Donkey Kong Country 2. It is Kong Quest. This game is probably going to be the second most delayed game we've, we've ever played. <laughs> Next to uh, Mario World. <laughs> so, I'm, I'm just here for the memes. And chill and relax. Have fun. Chill content. <laughs> oh, man. I love I love the animation of... Um, I mean, the sure, exactly. Dell drawing I got because it's. I look at my phone and I have that as my my, my screensaver when I, my lock screen. What are you doing? I don't want to play this game. I'm just making sure it's actually working. <laughs> get back in there, Diddy. I forgot what button it is. Ah. Uh, yeah, get over here. <laughs> All right, time to commit some genocide. Yay, genocide! Oh, there we go. Ooh, nine? What was that for? Oh, eight. The amount of Kremlings in front of you? Oh, you're racing technically, right? Yeah. Oh, uh, I missed one. I guess he could still live to sell his friends. <laughs> Having more than the rest. <laughs> oh, there you go. Is it possible to lose this race, like, naturally? Yeah, but it doesn't punish you or anything. You just don't get anything. Oh, I got you. Like a, like a crim coin or something like that, right? Yeah. Okay. Seems like it's very generous with your jumping. Like, you could be at the very edge of the rail and still be able to jump somehow. Oh, I got distracted by that. <laughs> uh, uh, you well, want to give it a drop? Uh, so this is how you play the game, and I'm like, uh, no. Whoa, what? Wait, what? I thought I killed you. <laughs> no, you, you have, you have at it. I'll give me a time, chance to actually observe for a change. Go for that, but I'm not my YouTube. Uh, what was I gonna say? Uh, but yeah, um, because it's not really a secret or anything, but uh, I am lactose intolerant. <laughs> That was my, my topic. I found out about a couple of years ago, and uh, now all I drink is lactose free milk. And that's the long and short of it. Um, if I ever go out to eat somewhere and like, they have a milkshake, I have to go in with the idea of, like, yeah, I'm gonna feel some pain later tonight. But it's totally worth it to drink that delicious chocolate shake. Which nowadays, speaking about shakes, and I'm not talking about the grimace shake, I'm talking about just in general regular shakes. Um, like, have you ever been to a point where you see the, the chocolate milkshake and the the wonder and pizzazz of that is no longer there? <laughs> I I'm so distracted by this conversation. <laughs> like, I go to I go to the, the like if I go to a restaurant or anything and they they, they have a thing on the store, uh, store the uh, the menu and they say we have chocolate vanilla strawberry milkshake and then some some places will have like the Oreo milkshake, right? And I think to myself, as a kid, I'd be like, oh my goodness, chocolate milkshake, I want to get one of those. And then your parents would proceed to be like, oh no, it's too expensive, it's like $5 for that, it's not worth it. Or, nah, you don't want to have sweets with your with your actual food. Or just it's flat out, no. <laughs> so, later in your teenage years, when you get a little bit more freedom to do stuff, you just be like, oh, I did I, uh, I'm, I'm gonna get myself a milkshake. And then you get the milkshake and you realize it's good, but it's not as good as your heart was telling you could have been. <laughs> Can't catch my drift. And now I go, I, I went to Denny's like a couple days ago with my mom and dad, and we, we bought the, um, we bought some food that we normally don't get. Well, what's going on here? Yep, I'm gonna need you for a moment. Oh, okay. Ugh. Anyway, uh, oh, need me? Oh, do you need me to glide over there? No, nope. uh, it's too short. Just throw me upwards. Yep, like that. And then try and glide over there. Oops. Oh. Ah, whoa. Okay, I tried to push the button like right off the bat, but there there needs to be like a. A gap in between. It's not instantaneous like I like it. Okay, <laughs> what are we doing here? Destroy! Destroy I mean, kill them all! <laughs> Alright, that's all you, buddy. 
Oh, no, no, it's no. me. <laughs> oh. Oh, there is one. Eh, good enough. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, what are we doing? It's just looping in circles. Okay. Okay, now you can... Yeah, it's all you. Okay, so, my milkshake story. <laughs> I, uh... Yeah, so nowadays I go to I go to a restaurant and I'm like, yeah, but it's so generic. Like I want something I, I want a completely different milkshake, something that that wows me. You know, like uh, I, like I said, I went to Denny's and normally I'd get like a burger, but I'm kind of sick and tired of the same burgers from there. And I wouldn't buy anything else on Denny's menu because there's nothing new <laughs> on the menu. <laughs> Remember, <laughs> we got a coin, so you might as well take the life. <laughs> Uh, so, so we ended up we ended up getting I got this thing from Denny's they said it was new it was like a, a was it a meat brisket on top of mac and cheese and had onion rings on top of that with like a glaze and I was like oh man that that sounds really good and um, I enjoyed it I was pleasantly surprised I was like man I wish there would be like uh, drinks that you know, that were new <laughs> that people would make up. So that way, going to the restaurant feels more like a refreshing change of pace as opposed to okay, I guess I'll get the same thing I normally get. You know, I, I remember back back in the day when McDonald's, Taco Bell, and Burger King were throwing out like random junk in the menu, and there I was happy to go ahead and try it all because I was, it was new, it was different. <laughs> Not everything was good. I'm looking at you, McDonald's wrap. <laughs> <laughs> but, but um, yeah, I, uh, I definitely, I definitely yearn for the day where we get variety in our menu. I understand the pandemic has ruined a lot of food options for people, but come on, we can't be constantly thinking about the pandemic is is yeah the reason for every bad thing. We gotta, we, wow, you keep falling off in the same spot. <laughs> I I just want us to enjoy unique burgers again. You know, unique food options that you don't normally see in the Oh, that was that Spider-Man burger. Dude, I actually went to go buy that when they had it on uh, at Burger King. And you know what they told me? We're all out. <laughs> We're all out of this. And then I showed up a week later and they said it's been discontinued. I'm like, what? But it's been a week since you guys announced it. <laughs> uh, I was so mad. I really wanted to try my Red Whopper. <laughs> Remember the jump coming up. All right, all right. We're quiet because we we're, we're waiting. We're all watching. Oh, that was a long level. No checkpoints, huh? Oh, he's quiet for reasons. He's, he's in gamer focus mode. And so we got Diddy and Dixie. Bring Third it. place. No winning medals. Yeah, there is it. For a tradition, they must take their own life. <laughs> in seppuku style. Alright, where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, you can only do that. Never mind. Not really even worth it. <laughs> Was there anything a plot point that you needed for um, uh, what you would call it, the uh, getting in first place? Uh, I think it gives you a DK coin. All right, where are we going? Mudhole Marsh. This is where we're supposed to go next. Yep. Okay, I can't really tell. I'm used to the Mario format where everything's kind of in a straight line. <sighs> So yeah, um, hmm. that, that that topic went went places. <laughs> um, let me let me think in terms of like menu options uh, and all that. I am a big advocate of going to a restaurant and uh, hey, look at Sonic the Head Not Hedge. <laughs> oh, uh, which we call it? Uh, I am a big proponent of buying burgers at restaurants. But only just to see how the burgers stack up against the ones that we could make at home. Because uh, at home, uh, we end up... Um, oh, that's, that's really cool. 
Uh, at home, we end up making the burgers on um, kind of like thick, like really thick slabs. And a lot of the time, they end up being... Um, oh! Side swipe. They end up being like very chunky I did not. Good. Oh, wow. He went from where I was going to jump. Yep, the first one goes above, and the second one goes below. Mm. Ladies and gentlemen, I just realized you called it 626 again. <laughs> just, uh, ongoing gag here. But yeah, so um, in terms of like Denny's and all that stuff, uh, I don't know. I used to have like a safe menu option to go for. Um, being like... It's like the double cheeseburger just because there was a lot of meat in that stuff. But uh yeah. Is it even worth opening up that chest? Eh, bananas. Oh. Okay. Uh Nope, that's it. Huh. What are you looking for? Anything, really. Looking for love in the wrong chest. <laughs> yeah, this this art style, uh, the art style they use for this game. Wow, okay. It's art style for this game. Sure. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> the art style they use for this game. <laughs> Crash, get back into PlayStation 1. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm still. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna like, just flat out kill myself. Ah, oh. <laughs> I was trying to spin well, into that. There was an attempt. An attempt, yeah. Uh, yeah, the the, the art direction for this game uh, looks it, it confuses my brain. <sighs> oh man. The three are superimposed onto uh to the platforms. Yeah, just the way everything looks, it's hard to distinguish things from ourselves. I, I've been playing traditional 2D games for so long, like the, the Mario and Sonic stuff, that I expect things to have a certain type of cohesion. Uh, this is not saying that the game is bad for this, it's just to me, I get lost in the background, and it's hard for me to distinguish what is a platform and what is not. <laughs> uh. Unlike Sonic Colors, the colors just don't feel right <laughs> for me anyway. Like, I look at Sonic, uh, was it, what's the new Sonic game that they announced? The old four player multiplayer? Uh, Superstars. Superstars, yeah. Yeah, that could have used a, di a better name, in my opinion. But, uh, I look at that and, like, yeah, okay, I, and there's, I can see what I'm looking at. Yeah. Speaking of which, um,. I know you're busy uh, clobbering some Kremlin minions and all that stuff, but uh, are we have we done Sonic Generations yet? I don't I don't think so. Because I know one of our first Let's Plays was Sonic uh, <laughs> Sonic Forces. <laughs> and we beat that in one city. And still still can't uh, forget that. Just beating the entire game in one city. Oh man, um, and then I know we did Sonic Adventure one and two because that's when I had way more friends sitting in the in the um, in the call during that period of time. Yeah. And then what was it? Uh, we did Shadow the Hedgehog's Expert Bone, so that counted. Uh, let's see. I know we've done we've done Sonic Mania like twice already. Oh no. I guess that doesn't work. At the end, just get. So we done all the Sonic collection games except for the Game Gears, which no, thank you. <laughs> but you don't want to play Sonic Triple Trouble? <laughs> uh, good, but just doesn't have to be charge. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. What does this do? Ah! <laughs> okay. 
Lost cause. Oh. So close. Yeah. Alright, does it oh. respawn? They don't respawn? Very strong. Even if there is, I don't want to go back. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, uh, oh, that's another game we haven't done yet, Sonic and the Secret Rings. <laughs> oh god, no! I still have, uh, I still have a save data, um, on my, on my, uh, Wii. That, uh, oh, this will actually give you an opportunity to redeem yourself. With, like, the cannonball. Woo! Oh, you drowned. I don't know if I'm doing that the right way or the wrong way. Wow, I hit jump. <laughs> I hit yeah, jump. you gotta. Hit, I guess you gotta lean to the side right. or hit the left or right. You know. Yeah. I don't understand fully, but. Yeah. So yeah, Sonic and the Secret Rings and Sonic and the Black Knight. Debatably, I don't. I feel like I almost don't want to even play those games. <laughs> They've been, uh, they're the kind of games that feel like they're just not complete. Like, I I know I'd have more fun playing Sonic 06 than those games. And I played Sonic 06, so I, I, I have every right to talk about, about that. <laughs> Besides, you already played the, uh, Sonic, uh, party game in, uh, dang it! Oh. Same mistake as last time. The Sonic Party game in the... Ah. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> um, the Sonic Party game in Rings. This is Sacred Rings. Didn't... I played that with Diego, huh? No, I played that with Michael and Reggie, I think. That was a long time ago. Very long time ago. Yeah, whenever I have to play Wii games, I definitely have to get, like, a new pack of batteries just to make sure everything's all set. Uh, just a heads up, maybe you should consider, uh, getting a safe state. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, the, uh, Secret Rings, uh, party board. I, I, I know we were riffing on it, but I don't think it was that bad. I think it's, uh, fun enough to qualify as you could play that game at least once <laughs> and be okay. Why wow. would you do that? Go, go, go. Oh, no! I already got the safe point. He's like, you know dance, he's monkey, dance! Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow, same place. Oh. Same state. <laughs> Gotta create one once we get to those cat of nine tails. Uh, and here's the thing, I remember, uh, because Sonic of the Secret Rings was the, um, was the one game I had that was new on the Wii for quite some time, I did play an, an, uncom <laughs> an uncomfortable amount of, of time into that game, and it was more of, um, of a lack of doing anything else that I was able to unlock, like, the fastest skill stuff for Sonic. Uh, like, you could get him, like, max speed. I don't know if it actually made a difference, like, oh, speed level of 9 or whatever, and those extra effects. But definitely, uh, oh, okay, <laughs> cool. <laughs> but definitely it was one of those games I, I put too much time into it and realized it was it was really for naught. And then my arm got really sore because, my arms in that case, because of all the shaking you had to do. Which, nobody likes to shake the, the remote and Black Knight was more was worse on my arm. Just basically, Oof. just all you're doing is jump slashing, jump slashing. There was no skill in that game. I, I would probably say, <laughs> well, oh okay. I, I'd probably say the, um, the Sonic and the Secret Rings. Oh, <laughs> I'd probably say Sonic and the Secret Rings is probably my my least favorite, one of my least favorite Sonic games of all time.
And uh, there's gonna be a lot of people's favorites. Then there's the weirdos who try to defend it in the weirdest ways. Like, there rarely even any good reasons. <laughs> you have a safety, yeah, okay. Well, at least I get to retry that, uh. Destroy them all thing now that I know it's destroy them all. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> yeah, it's all of us when we're having a conversation. Um, but yeah, so. The, um. It's not like gonna seek rings and, uh. Black Knight, those are probably my, my least favorite to ever go back to. They are the origami king of Sonic games for me. <laughs> but people like origami king. Oh, well, those people are wrong. I'm just gonna say that much. They have incorrect tastes because origami king sucks. Everything but the story was great. Sorry, uh, yeah, everything but the story was bad. And here's the thing: a story can be watched on YouTube <laughs> if I really wanted to. Ah, no. Why can't I go into a spin? I should have the right to spin after I jump off a platform. Okay, I blame you, you Diddy. <laughs> uh, anyway. Uh, what was this? Gotta like? sing. Oh yeah, Origami King. I, you, you, dude, you cannot tell me I don't know because I never played the game. I, I have played that game, and went from point A to point B. And I, 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 I think I send them in the majority where people even sell out the final boss was such a stupid screw you moment to the player because it had so much great set pieces, it had so much great flavor, and then that final part just completely destroyed any momentum that you had during that epic boss fight. And I was about to save it for me for that game, but knowing knowing what I know now, that ruins the game for that. That ruins me wanting to get to the end of the game. Oh my goodness! Reset. Let yeah. me just try. <laughs> it, was, it, did, it just. Oh God! Oh no! You're 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 soft blocked. <laughs> All right, I just need to time this perfectly. Okay. Ah. I would suggest probably safe stating there, so you don't have to constantly pull that off. Because <laughs> we're degenerates like that. We play our old games of safe states. But anyway, what does it say? Uh, but yeah, Origami King, if I were to give you a one word review of the entire game, I would just call it boring. What? It's poisonous. You gotta run. Yeah. <laughs> That happened. I don't claim to be really great at video games at all of them. But I claim to have fun when I play video games. I, I, I'm, I'm reaching 30 years old. Like, how old are you now, dude? 31. You're 31. I'm, t I'm going to be 29 this year if I make it that long. And I'm be I got to the point where I just... Whoa. whoa. <laughs> I just do not care if, uh, if people say, Oh, you're terrible at video games. I'm like, shut up. I have a job. <laughs> <laughs> no. Great. No. What am I doing over here? Barrel hopping. Just like in college. <laughs> <laughs> well, there is gone college. <laughs> oh, I see what they wanted. No. <laughs> Yeah, we already made the mistake. No wonder I'm going back. <laughs> yeah, that's a beauty to clean up with. <laughs> I ain't touching this game by myself. Um, what was it? What was it? Oh yeah, so video games in general, like uh, I, I am, I am one of those people that just do not care. People say, "Oh, well, you suck at video games." I'm like, "Yeah, tell me that like 20 years ago, and then I'll care." I don't care anymore. <laughs> I remember back then it used to be like a big old sin, like, you couldn't beat this game on the first try, I did it, my dad did it, his mom did it, and I can't believe a squirt like you can't do it, you're bad at video games, you know that? And then at that time you're like, I'm so sorry, I'll play it again, I'll do it right, and you're like, yeah, you better do it right, or else we're gonna shame you in public, 
Because back then they didn't have social media, so they did it in front of you. So, you know, like that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, why are we stuck on the screen? Uh, I thought we were only going to do two levels, I, but I also didn't want to interrupt your story. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, well, then we'll see you guys next time when we play this a year from now. So, until then, bye-bye. Bye! -bye. Bye. <laughs>